recording? No, he's like, Dad, you were like in the back, passed out, and they're still doing weird stuff. <laughs> doing weird stuff. <laughs> I can't really laugh because I don't know what that entails exactly. Cause... Well, I remember you like puking in a crash can up here. Oh, no, I puked in the, the mug. The shit that we're drinking out of, I puked in. Oh, absinthe no. was actually <laughs> nasty. Oh yeah, that was that was a special evening. So I have the timer set because I haven't figured out how to make that go beyond a certain time. But hopefully we won't go over that time. That's new. That's yeah. Marissa got cool. that for me. <clears throat> Alrighty. Ready? Woohoo! Ready. In three, two, one. Welcome to Illusions Nerdery. This is going to be a BBR, and with me is... Art Aramis. Steel Fox. And we have a guest off camera. Hi. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Hi. People are like, what's going on? <laughs> so, this is going to be a uh, special BBR. <clears throat> a uh, co-worker of mine by the name of Mike. <clears throat> I won't disclose his last name in case he doesn't want it disclosed, but Mike gifted the BBR boys these awesome brews. So, the cool thing about these, aside from being Star Trek themed, this one's Vulcan Ale. Warnog. Warnog. Klingon Warnog. And Syndicate. The really cool thing about these is that Mike did the artwork for the labeling. So, I believe he did this he did the cans. You should see if you can get some close-ups on those after. Uh, take pictures and. Yeah. And then he did. It's good work. He did the artwork on this one, I believe, and he did the art direction on one of the rocks. Yeah. Well, not collaboration. He actually did the art direction. So someone else did the artwork, but he <laughs> did his thing. So yeah. Sweet. So he watched our videos. Thank you, Mike, for watching, and hopefully I'll more you. Yeah. <laughs> Yay! Woo! Please click like. <laughs> I heard we do stupid stuff when we get drunk. <laughs> so, we're going to give these a try, and um, see how they are. Any preferences? Anyone? Eyeballing this guy here. The Vulcan Ale. I actually, and these... This Seems products, like a logical choice. <laughs> And these are actually from okay, Spock. Canada. I think, well, there, there's two groups of brewmasters, if I remember correctly. They're his friends up in Canada, and there's also an American-type branch to, to this. And this is legit Federation of Beer.com. So, um, hopefully they're good. They've been kind of chilling out in the nursery. Uh, Leonard Nemo, because he's on the label. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Whoa, 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 whoa! It's an exciting little beer. Yeah, it has a very worky head on it. <laughs> yeah. I'm actually gonna grab a towel. Oh yeah. That. Before that gets. That's hoppy. Yeah, it's hard to get it out of the feeder. Don't give me a lot. I know. Still, Fox is is not a I'm not a beer fan. He's not a beer fan. Give me grain alcohol. <laughs> that kind of goes for all of us. Written on it? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Check her out. I'm gonna give her a taste. What language? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that'd be that'd be clean. Yeah. Or, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. He he. Uh, Mike actually knew what this there said at is. one time. Because they actually had one of the Vulcan or Klingon linguists. You know that's actually been ratified mm -hmm. as an actual language. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's crazy. That is crazy. So Vulcan ale, give it a try. Mm. Very hoppy. Very hoppy. Hoppy but drinkable. Yeah, it's smooth. Yeah, it's yeah, like it's not really harsh back end on it, but no. And that's yeah. coming from a non beer drinker. Mm -hmm. yeah. But it's very, what is that? very hoppy. It's, a, it's almost Guinness y. Yeah, uh, that's what it's like. Yeah, it's I'm like not getting the red back season. dark flavors. It's a red IPA. Uh, it's, it's, yeah, it's really smooth like that. It's, you know, more, a little bit more carbonated than. Uh, yeah, a lot more carbonated. Guinness, Guinness. So, Vulcan Ale, the Genesis Effect. 
That's good though. I like it. Beer, five point four percent alcohol by volume. It's not bad. It's a smooth beer. Mm. You know what I'd do with it? Schmaltz. I like dark and hoppy beers. What would you do with it? Cook Lots with it? Too Cook better. with it. That's what I thought you were gonna say. It could be good. Mm. Boil your hot dogs. It's down hoppy, but it's not exceedingly bitter. Mm. Some brats. Yeah, boil some hot dogs before you put them on the grill. Give them that nice crisp. Well, let's keep this mess batter. going. I like it. Save a splash for women. I like it. I like it. Okay. This one I'm curious about just because I really <laughs> like the label. Not that you can see it all that clear. I always I pour you a very little amount every time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But you guys are all done. I'm like over here. <laughs> what the heck? Because you, you take smaller beer. swallows than the rest of us, so. <laughs> you have such a delicate throat. <laughs> Are you a Dutch yet? I don't want to hear about your large swallows. <laughs> <laughs> I was so, talking about the bird, but you know. Orion Seductress. Authentic Czech. Longer. There was a lot more in there than I thought there it's was. It's a Chex bear. It's a big cup, dude. When and you're driving home. <laughs> Syndicate. So this is Syndicate, the green chick. I thought the green chick was hot. Was she from the bedroom scene? I don't care which we'll have to ask season Mike. or which, yeah. which <clears throat> carnation of Star Trek. If there's a green chick, I'm interested. <laughs> don't take that bottle with you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Unless it's gangrenous, then maybe. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, no, let's not go there. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a spear? <laughs> oh. Apparently, Vulcan Ale doesn't make you any that's wittier, that's, that's for damn yeah. sure. <laughs> that's interesting. Yeah, kind of a different high note on it. Definitely tastes like an IPA. It says it's a, a lager. Authentic Czech lager. Czech, Czech lager. Czechoslovakia. Is Czechoslovakia even Czechoslovakia anymore? Lord only knows. I do not know. It's subtle. It's. Yeah. I don't know what it is. It's way more subtle than this. Yeah. Definitely a different flavor. That is interesting. Well, the hops aren't the lead in it. What would I no. compare that to? They're I don't definitely know. supporting role, but. It's like a, like a, a hoppy light beer. It's kind of like a Corona. Mm. It's like a little bit spicier Corona to me. Mm. <laughs> That's a summer Czechs, beer. <clears throat> Czechs lager drinkers are probably like, oh, you fools! <laughs> <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's not Corona! <laughs> yeah. That'd be a out in the summer sun kind of needs a back of beer. That's a that's a that'd be good on a hot sunny day. It needs like a wedge of orange. Or oh, like an orange slice dropped yeah. in there. Bloop. Lime wedge or lime. lemon wedge. Yeah. So so far, I'm, I really like this Vulcan ale. Mm -hmm. And the sad thing is, I don't. We definitely don't see these locally in stores. No around here but that would be cool to pick up again <laughs> this I'm not so sure of mm. I could definitely see maybe pick up a six-pack and enjoying on a hot sunny day but I, I like that so the so war nog Klingon war nog ale is it a true ale? ale it just says ale one pint 5.5 Star Trek it's even licensed through CBS Studios so it's it is legit. legit and it's really cool that I know the guy that did the artwork that's we are making a mess on the bar <laughs> that's what happens to a lot of bars that's why they call it a wet bar and Mike did warn that this might have an interesting taste because I guess it's been in his stockpile for a while. Mm. So we shall see. It's going to taste like Klingon. 
<laughs> Klingon sweat. <laughs> you can ferment that? But it smells Whoa, like Whoa, yeah. How long has it been in your stockpile? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to see if he uh, either throws up or falls over. <laughs> oh shit, he did it. What does that taste? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. <clears throat> That's so much different. <laughs> it was just wow. Like, <laughs> after drinking these two, this is like... <laughs> what? <laughs> um... That's almost more like a wine than a... <laughs> How long have they been sitting wherever? Reminds me of that. Like one of those nut brown ales. A very smooth, mild... Oh. <laughs> and a Sam Adamsy. Wow. I can't believe you. How many times you've gone back already. Well, he's all warmed up for the other stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just trying to like... Mm. Identify with it. It's not. It's not really bad. I mean, no, but it would it, have been. There, it, it'd be a difference if it was straight different. off the tap. Yeah. Reminds me of a nut brown ale. Hmm. Kind of has a bitter end note. The spicy rye flavor of victory it will pair <clears throat> perfectly with the heart. I'm not getting much rye off it. Day of honor. The smell of earth. earth. The smell of earth clove. We'll pry you from here. Smell of earth? How do you say that? Fill your next grail <laughs> with war dog. Hmm. It doesn't it's follow. Cool. It does not follow these two well. No. 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 Standing on its own in the right setting might be okay, but Character. I don't know if it's because it's a, you know, canned or. Cook chicken with it. Like, I don't really, it's not really an off flavor. I mean, it, it, I, it's probably what it's supposed to taste like. It's just... Oh, Federationofbeer.com hmm. hmm. Yeah, it's like, it's like one of those kind of nut brown ale type. Yeah. Mm, I'm not offended by it. I mean, oh, it's, no, no. It, it, it's like drinkable. It, yeah. right, right setting, not following other beer. These, those two? Yeah, this one's got my vote. I'll mix them all up. <clears throat> yes, <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, made that mistake Cling on cocktail. I got the beer sweats. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. thank you. So, what do you think, Still Fox? What's your what, what is your favorite out of these three? The first one, yeah. actually. See, I followed my instincts. The first one I picked, that was you know, I was like. Um, like that one, there's, that one's calling out. To I me. think this one would like would have been better oh, if we hadn't too. started with the first two. Yeah, this probably would have been decent. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> if we Lay started down, with it. Finish with the. <laughs> we should have went this, this, and then this. But um, yeah, I like the uh, red season IPA as well, and I'm not a big hoppy guy. Give me guy. just a tiny bit more of that. This one, there's, see how... Like, do you want the rest of it? No, I'm actually getting more bitter out of this one. Though. Okay, whoa. whoa. I just wanted to see what that was like following this and see Ew. if it was just sort of an unfair boat. <laughs> Poor Warnog. Nobody likes Cleveland. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. Yeah. It's just the. Uh, it it it, it, that could totally just be tainted palette because, I mean, that's. It's, it was even hard going back to that. Back to this? Yeah. It just totally. I mean, yeah, it kind of it's 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 all, beer though. Yeah, you kind of have to stick with one strain. Oh, that brought out the hop. That's mm -hmm. for sure. It just like comes out and smacks you upside the head. Now. Wow, <laughs> very hoppy though. No, 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 don't mix. <laughs> don't do it. So, pretty awesome. Um, so less than beer. Don't mix yeah. your beers. <laughs> now what you want to do is, um, overall. Ooh. Not bad. <laughs> After what was the, that? <laughs> I, was, yeah. I just got possessed by About the put a dollar in your pants. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's better than steel reserves. So. <laughs> I don't know. I've had some fun on steel reserves. 
high altitude. <laughs> but um, overall, I liked them. I, I even like the Warnog, but like you said, this is very stout. But stick with it. Yeah, I hope they're Don't still making Don't bounce around. Those. That is really cool. Uh, the Vulcan L has my vote. I'd actually say this next, Warnog, and then lastly, yeah, the um, Syndicate. Syndicate. Goodness. But overall, good beers. Yeah, very bad. lovely. Good yeah. beers. Yeah, very carbonated. And um, to Mike, thank you. Much appreciated. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Thank you for the brews. It was awesome doing this uh, BBR. And it fits right in. Yeah. The nerdery and Star Trek Star beer. Trek beer. <laughs> That's <laughs> wow. Um, I did ask him what uh, if he had any Romulan mm. ale. <gasps> but apparently... Someone has it trademarked in Vegas. One of the big hotels has it trademarked. Oh, really? And I was like, oh, that's a bummer because these guys who actually have these licensed thought about it, or I think they might have not thought about it. But anyway, I asked him, and he said, there's a place in Vegas, one of the big hotels, when they have it trademarked. But the bummer part is they're using like a nasty regular light beer recipe that tastes like crap according to mike and it's like oh what a bummer because that's just tarnishing the romulan ale name i always thought of it more as a grain alcohol and not an yeah. actual beer but hey oh it's just like the cling on blood wine <laughs> that'd be fun <laughs> now if you get us some of that yeah, hmm. yeah. finish yeah. this off i have taste I have tasted that before, and I'm just trying to place <laughs> which, where? narrow which, it down. Yeah, which beer? I've had a beer that is like identical to that. I'm trying to remember what it was. Well, you two are beer guys. I'm. Yeah, I, maybe, it's, it's maybe actually like, been a while since I've like been a, a beer Heineken beer guy. or something. Yeah, uh, or yeah. Um, what is that Australian one? Foster's. Foster's. Foster's for beer. Deadly yeah. Foster's. <laughs> <laughs> Well, gentlemen. Oh, hey, we can crack this. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> uh, <laughs> what do we got down here? No, oh God! <laughs> I had so a big, um, I had a big dinner before I came over here. I was just like, oh, you start so you got a buffer. My bubbly. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, my name is Illusions. Steel Fox. Ardermus. Thank you for uh, watching, and if you can, <laughs> go and find like. yourself some Star Trek beer and yeah. like. Thank you. Please. 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 Please.